It's going to be, a, for us, an interesting season, moving into a new conference. Why, uh, we've played four of the teams in the past, so we have a little bit of an idea about them, but the rest of them uh, don't have a clue what to expect from some of them. So that's going to be real exciting to, uh, for us as a team. And uh, I think the uh, fun part will be that we have a lot of returners. And that experience uh, is always nice to have back when you go into something new. Uh, so really looking forward to that. I think it's going to be a fun time for us and the players. There's certain aspects of it. Uh, I don't know what the competitive uh, difference between Division One and Division Two is. And I, I'm going to have to go back now and start all my notes over again because I have files on um, almost all of the Division II teams, so I had pretty good ideas on coaches on how to how to play them and what to do, and, and now we've got to start over again. So it, I'm kind of looking forward to it. it. It gives me something to get excited about. I guess sometimes you get kind of lulled to sleep, you know, because you've done this for uh, – several years in my case. And so that gives you something new to think about and do. And, and it's, it's been a real blessing to me to uh, get in and get after some things and try to get some things figured out. Well, obviously we'd have to start with uh, Taylor Nashert, who uh, led the nation in assists last year and, and uh, was an honorable mention All-American. Uh, Taylor, uh, really worked hard over the summer and uh, uh, she's been a real pleasure to uh, to be around and coach uh, in the last two years and uh, she's looking forward to having a, a fun senior year and then uh, we go back to Maddie Westergaard uh, our post player uh, she was all league last year and uh, uh, gives you a, a good stationary uh, and uh, person that can run the court really well and, and uh, she's really played uh, pretty well in, in the uh, stuff that we've done so far this year uh, then we <clears throat> that fly's gonna get me <laughs> then we got have uh, Brittany Holland and Brittany uh, uh, has uh, she was a, a very sound score last year and ran the floor quite well for us and, and was really kind of a, a, a go-to person for us at times and Britt uh, uh, is a very impact type player and uh, she, she's, she's a fun one there. Uh, Renice Collier only played the second semester for us but made all league last year and uh, uh, we're looking forward to, to uh, Renice uh, doing some really uh, good things for us uh, down on the inside. And uh, um, she's a competitor, and that's really good. I like that kind of stuff. And then we have uh, Emily Bell was a letterman. Uh, Taylor Biancalana was a letterman. And uh, so those people... Uh, will be very, very helpful to us also. And uh, uh, we have some, some transfers that uh, uh, we're looking forward to uh, being an integral part of us as they pick up the system and get them with it. So uh, overall, I think we have a pretty good nucleus of about 10 or 11 kids that we can play. And uh, you've been around me for a long time, so you know that's a little different than what I like to do, but uh, we're going we're gonna to go that route. Well, you know me. Uh, defense is the thing that I like most. And uh, I think when we had our turnaround last year was when we decided that we were going to play defense. And then we uh, went away from every time down the floor launching a three within five or six seconds and went into playing uh, so the ball went in into the post players and stuff, and uh, that'll be the same, you know. Uh, we're going to have a lot of post touches, but 
we're going to get after you defensively really hard.